past performances. I don't know if I could say like that one, but bad performances here in this arena. Uh, why do you guys keep having these types of performances in this arena? Let's just stick to tonight, Paul. It wasn't uh, it wasn't good enough. We we know that, and uh, we'll go right to work tomorrow. And as we'll go right to work right now on that. Um, and, and there's no. I've stood here before in situations like this and told you I have conviction and confidence that we'll resolve it, and we will. You know, I I don't say this lightly. You, you went into the second period three to one, gave up a late goal. It looked like, I mean, how do you count for a period where it looks like your team quit on themselves, quit on you, quit on the fans, quit on everybody? They had a tough night. They had a tough night. And, and it was, uh, that did not like the first goal of the second period, which was a simple coverage botched. They will, um, you know, it's, it's unfortunate, obviously. Um, like I said to Paul, we will we will use this as uh, the the appropriate way, and I have confidence that it will make us better. Did you ever think your, this team could look like that in a game? Did you ever think that was possible? <laughs> you know, you're 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 in you're in a league you're in. I mean, it's it's you you have breakdowns. And uh, it can end up in the back of your net. And we had breakdowns. It happens in this league every night. You have breakdowns, it's in your net. So you got to be on, and we were off. And when you're off, that's what happens. So this can happen and does happen throughout the league. And it happened tonight because we're, we were off. And, and we have to own that, and we do. And we, it has to make us better. So you have confidence. What gives you that confidence? These, this, this group is resilient. They care, and those two, those two traits will will push them through. Don, with all due respect, people do look at the trends of this, how the season has gone, and look beyond just tonight. If this was just a one-off, then perhaps I think there might be some exceptions, you know, exceptions made. But for a team that's not won consecutive games except for once this year. How, why can you not pinpoint what's been off too many times during the course of the season leading up to tonight? Dif different nights. Uh, first, first of all, John, I have a lot of respect for our fans. Lots of respect. And we go to work hard for them and, 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 um, and we'll continue to work hard. Um, you know, we... You, you take these things in like tonight, and there's there's plenty that we can obviously uh, take from this game and, and go over tonight as as a, as a staff and and give the guys a focus and, and dial in, and the guys have been have been good at that. So, like I said, confident we'll, we'll, we will resolve this. Most, most of your group is back from last season, Don. We've talked so much about. You know, all the goals you scored, what building on what you guys did last season, you know, the window opening and whatnot. But do you feel like all those factors considered that the group just got too comfortable and maybe thought that they arrived when, in fact, it's a new season and there's going to be different challenges that come with that? In, in moments, I think, through, throughout a year, yes, guys, you do feel too comfortable at times. That happens. Uh, and you've got to you've got to learn from it and adjust. And I think we're learning from it and adjusting. You know, tonight we came out score a goal right away, and a couple other times then after the goal we didn't get pucks deeper to the net or guys pushing to the net. So uh, yes, sticking to it and 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 consistency, absolutely. How concerned are you in a situation you're in with an impatient fan base? At times in the past, an impatient owner, a game like that, knowing how this league runs, we've seen coaches lose jobs routinely. I mean, how concerned do you get when you look at that dynamic? My concern is on making this group better tomorrow. It was my concern from day one, and it, it'll stay my concern. We are going to make this team better. And, and I said it with absolute respect for our fan base. And, and when we go to work and I don't sleep, and it's, it's because of that. We care about that. We want to do good on that. 
and um, I still can stand here with confidence that we will. Don, you had uh, six players in the locker room, when, and it was a pretty short wait. You had six guys, including your captain, and one guy who couldn't talk because he took a puck to the mouth. What does that matter? Should that matter? I'm sorry. Uh, I, I, six guys in the locker room. You know, everybody was gone. You know, talk about accountability, and there's all kinds of different ways to do accountability. But when we walk into the locker room, two thirds of your team was gone. Um, nobody wanted to deliver any answers or come up with anything about tonight. What? what yeah, I, I, I think they probably. There's a lot for them to internalize for tonight. Is is what I would say. What I would suspect. Right after that, um, you know, they're 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 not happy with performance. Uh, you mentioned six guys were in there out of out of twenty. Um, yeah, if there's more guys you'd like to get in touch with, uh, you know, we'll we'll they'll be accessible. Um, so all I can tell you is, uh, if you wanted more, I can apologize to you. But and we can and we can correct it. But uh, but you know, as far as them coming off the rink and 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 having, you know, there's a lot for them to process. Uh, obviously tonight. Um, it's a competitive group and a proud group, and tonight, uh, you know, these these types of nights are humbling, and sometimes it, uh, you know, these are athletes that, you know, sometimes they can't verbalize everything they feel as well. So, Don, what can you take away from when Tage and Kyle did flip the script and push the scoring momentum the other way? What can you take away from what happened after that? What happened after that? I mean, giving scoring, up? Yeah. yeah. Again, we, we know we need to be better. We need to be and better means more consistent. Don, so, pardon me, um, Don. Knowing full well that this is a young team, we we know that so many times this year, one goal against has turned into three, four occasionally. What is causing that to be a repeat occurrence with this group? Well, I I, I could speak for tonight. The first goal, um, you know, the first goal was a botched retrieve. Um, Ended up going off a referee, and it wasn't a good play to begin with, you know. Um, the second one was uh, was a back check mistake, unfortunately, and the third one was a power play uh, through the end of the feet or at the end of the period. But there was absolute to me there was a lull in the second period. Um, we we botched the play after that, um, but the lull for me was the second period. As Mike mentioned, good. Uh, 